Alright, right, YouTube, what's going on? It's TV back here. Or it's Trovo now. That's my new channel name. But hold on, let me put on my headphones real quick. So you can hear me better. You probably can't hear me so good right now. Hold up. All right, should be able to hear me better. And we're back. And we're with watching the game recap of the Reds game last night. It's a pretty good one. So let's, let's hit it. Adam Frazier will play out opposite field single. The 1 0 pitch, runner goes, swinging strike, throw to second, and it is in plenty of time. Scooter Jeanette with the tag. He had to come off the bag a little bit, but towards first, and it wasn't close. Frazier out by a mile at second base. And now Starling Marte will come up. And now he drives one to left field, and he has a yeah, contact indeed. A Marte Parte in the first inning, his 18th. Well, those first two pitches were right in the up and in part of the zone, and that's where Marte, you know, has struggles at times. And it kind of looked like they were trying to go back up there again. Yeah, they did. Maybe not as far as they would want it, but above the belt, inside half, he just turned on it. McRae about to make his first big league start. Bullpen numbers this year, just 14 innings. Have been starting at AAA Indy. He will love to push that up by four or five in this one. I think the Pirates will take three good ones. McRae starts for the reason he's starting today. There was supposed to be another guy, Jordan. Miles, he was supposed to start today, but he wasn't able to because he got traded to the Brewers earlier yesterday for a different guy. So, yeah, just want to let you guys know. Jordan Lyles. Got a swing and a ground ball up first. Bell has it. McCray over covers and gets the out. One away. And he gets the first out. First batter he faces as a starting pitcher in the majors. And he's at second with nobody well, out. Center, Scooter Jeanette. It's crazy. Jeanette rips one to right. That's on a line, and that's down. Oh, and it'll go all the way to the wall. Here comes Van Meter around third. He'll score. And Scooter Jeanette's in the second base with an RBI double. The ball's in a strike to count to Barnhart. And an end to right field, a base hit. They're going to wave around Scooter. Here comes the throw to the plate. And the Reds have taken the lead 2-1. to one. Barnhart on fire. They are loaded. Well, this is one of those spots where if you're the Reds offense, you have really got to cash this in. You've got a chance to just put a blowout on the board here early. Base hit down the left field line. This will score two. But a look out. He's on his way to second base. Winker stopped there, but he has time to get back to first after delivering the two RBI single for one Reds. And bases loaded again. And a walk, and he walks in a run. 5-1 Reds. There's the 1-1. Breaking ball, grounded to first, backhand pick Bell. He comes home with it, and safe at the plate. The throw was in the dirt, and Diaz had to come off the plate and went into protection mode and just blocked it. But Bell just lobbed that throw to the plate. He looked really awkward. That looked like Josh Bell had the yip. It did. I mean, he picked it up. I mean, that's a simple throw from first to home, and he got it, and he started thinking about it before he threw the ball, and that was not a good throw. Right center field. This ball is hit well. This ball is gone! Grand slam! Jose Iglesias! It is a 10 run. Reds wow. second inning. That's what I'm talking about. About that Reds offense due to have a big night. You were talking about that earlier. Hey, nobody feels sorry for you when you're giving up 10, so don't feel sorry for them <laughs> when they're giving up 10. Fifth inning coming up. Pirates are trailing 10 to 1. They'll send up Reynolds. The pitch. And a swing and a fly ball out to center. Winker back, still back, carrying, still back on this one. Gone! A home run for Brian Reynolds. His ninth of the year. And Reynolds leads off the fifth, making it 10 to 2. Went with the pitch that was out over the plate, hit it deep into the opposite gap, and it just kept going and going and going. Uh, an opposite field power. You don't look at Reynolds as a big, powerful guy, but he has power to all fields. It's so impressive. One on, one out, then two reds in the fifth. Oh, first. Payoff is sent in the air, Ooh, left center field to the gap. Oh, There's nobody there, and it nope. is off the oh, base man. of the wall. Oh, Winker well. over to play the carom, spins and fires it back in. Throw to the plate oh, from Iglesias, and it is in time. Oh, 
Ozuna out of the plate. Winker, Iglesias to Barnhart. And Iglesias just threw a dart right on the money to Barnhart. I'm going to tell you this. That was a great throw from Iglesias to the plate and a nice job by Barnhart to scoop it and move to the left. But that play was made by Jesse Winker in center field. If you don't get the carom off the wall and spin and fire a strike to Iglesias, Nothing else can happen after that. That was an awfully good play by Jesse Winker. And the Reds have him loaded with one out in the fifth. In the air. Second baseman. Frazier makes the play and everyone stays put. Major frustration from Puig. And he's going right underneath. Two and one the count on Josh Van Meter. It's by the catcher. Here comes Winker to the play. And the Reds add on 11-2. They are loaded up for Colin Moran. Got a couple of grannies. And to right field, and it is a grand slam for Colin Moran. His 11th of the year. Bucks within five, it's 11-6. Always looking to come back. 11-2. Now the top of the order, Kevin Newman. The one pick. And this is grounded off the end of the bat towards the middle. Iglesias field throws on the run in time. And that's it. Reds win it. 11 to 6, beating the Pirates to take the first of this three game series. And the Reds have won three in a row. All right. That'll be the end of the video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Peace.